Okay, we're at 27 Sophia Court in Novato. It's a two-story house. Um, <clears throat> hardy board siding and stucco. So the, the stucco and the hardy board, from what I can see, looks like it's in pretty good shape in the front. Um, there is a little bit of damage to some of the trim we'll look at as we go. And it's going to be, uh, and you could have a third color if you like. Uh, sometimes, see like your gutters, you know, are darker. And it matches your shutters and your front door, you know. So you could do any combination of colors. Yeah, yeah, like. uh, yeah. As I said, um, I decided two colors. I, the color I haven't decided is the shutter and uh -huh. the door. Yeah. So uh -huh. that might be the third color. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. All right. So the garage door is a separate color, or the two garage doors are a separate color from the uh, siding. Now we do have a little bit of dry rot up here in this corner. Um, as we poke around with it, we. We'll probably replace this board here, um, but we'll see what the damage entails on this one here. If that one's okay, we can maybe get away with it or replace that top board if we need to. Um, okay, that's pretty tight. Okay, I checked the bottoms of the trim on the wood. Because that's usually where some of the damage will start. Mm -hmm. Okay, looks pretty good so far. So you got an eight foot front door, six panel. That'll get painted in a separate color. White vinyl windows, no trim on the on the lower windows where it meets the stucco. But we have a one by four trim on the upper windows. Let's see. You got bird netting up there in the roof. Uh, that window trim looks okay. There's a, a little hole up there in the planner. Right, the, yeah. Okay. So we'll we'll check that out when we get up there. Mm -hmm. And uh, and like I said, some of this stuff we don't know until we get a ladder up there. You know. So those type of things. Mm -hmm. You know. If I find them, I'll talk to you about it. You know. Mm -hmm. We don't just do anything until we have your approval. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Coming around the front, we got painted shutters. So we got upper and lower shutters. There's three, four sets. And let me take a look at some of the trim in the garage window. Okay, looks pretty tight. Those are the little traps where water gets trapped in there. Sometimes leaves get in there mm. and it'll create a moisture trap. Mm -hmm. um, that's where you're going to likely get dry rot, you mm -hmm. know, in places like that. So, uh, so far, so good. Yeah. So how about, this is okay, right? Here, looks like. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yeah that's, that's totally, completely tight. So yeah. you're good there. Uh -huh. And anything like this, we take out the screw and we fill that hole, you know, seal mm -hmm. it up. So. Mm -hmm. Also, uh, some of the, not here, but some of the uh, nail popped out, so you're going to... Yeah, we set those. Yeah. Um, you can see some of them are where they popped out before. Looks mm -hmm. like they just kind of put a little caulking in there. Mm -hmm. um, and these types of things, when they build these houses, the nails are supposed to be flush. They're not supposed to sink them. Mm -hmm. You know, that's the uh, code is to make them flush, mm -hmm. just like you see here, just mm -hmm. flush with the surface. Mm -hmm. So all these, these don't get addressed, really. I mean, they get painted over. They're sealed up tight. So, you know, just so you know, this is the way they're supposed to be installed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah, but anyways, uh, anything like this where it's sunken in a little more, mm -hmm. we'll put a little caulking on that and level it off. I see. And then uh, I think they did, they used the, um, they didn't use the galvanized nail. Um, so, these this actually is rust yeah yeah any place or that'll be in my proposal too any place we find rust we use a rust inhibitor primer we mm -hmm. spot prime mm -hmm. any rust holes anything like that yeah because some i already sprayed but some i have i didn't uh-huh yeah <laughs> but we do that before okay. we paint mm -hmm. so when you get my proposal you'll see it's very detailed okay so you're going to see everything in there that we do mm -hmm. and that's one of the items i address i see so things like water stains, hard water stains on the surface, mm -hmm. we prime over that, and so mm -hmm, yeah, mm -hmm. you'll see it's very, very thorough. Okay. So do you have a warranty? Yeah, I provide a one-year warranty on our workmanship. Okay. 
and uh, the product has its own warranty. Okay. Um, <clears throat> but you know, a good paint job will last at least ten years. Okay. And uh, so that's pretty typical. Um, but yeah, I do provide a warranty on my work too. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I give you that in writing. Mm -hmm. No bug here. Okay, so the uh, hardy board stops here, so we got a border, a border trim. Uh, two side doors. It looks like a metal door, or is that fiberglass? Either way, that's going to get painted. Another side entry door here. Okay, so that looks pretty tight. Yeah. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six windows on this side. You got some more rust showing through here. Okay. Looks like you got a little little hole starting there. And actually, yeah, that could get filled and repaired. All right, and on the back, is it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 11, 12, that's four, five, nine, 10, 11, 13, 16 windows and an eight foot single light door. Okay. So all the windows are trimmed. And got, then uh, <coughs> it's in the foundation is painted down to the ground. So we'll we'll copy that. Then coming around to the last side of the house, one, two, three, four, five, six windows and another side entry door. And then uh, some heavy. Those are sunk in a little bit too much there, so we'll level those off. A little bit of peeling paint on the bottom trim. Okay, and that's about it.